Hello everyone, this is Sally from Sally Cosmos. In this video, we'll see how to divide any number by 9. So let's start with the terminology. Let's say we want to divide 82 by 9. This number is also called dividend. And this number is called the divisor. So in this video, our divisor will remain the same, but dividend would change. Also, when we divide 82 by 9, we get quotient as 9 which I will refer to as Q and we'll get remainder as 1 which I will refer to as R. So let's start. Suppose we want to divide 33 by 9. In this method, we'll scan the dividend from left to right. First step is to write this digit as it is. Now add this digit to this one. So 3 plus 3 becomes 6. That's it. So your quotient is this and the remainder is the last digit. Okay, let me take another another example. Suppose I want to divide 71 by 9. First step is to write this digit as it is. Now add this digit to this one. 7 plus 1 is 8. So your quotient is 7 and the remainder is 8. Okay, 421 divided by 9. Write this digit as it is. Add this digit to this one. 4 plus 2 is 6. Now add this digit to this one. 6 plus 1 is 7. So your answer is this with quotient 46 and the remainder 7. So easy. Let's take another example. 13 by 9. Write this digit as it is. Now add this digit to this one. So 3 plus 1 becomes 4. This is your answer with quotient 1 and remainder 4. Great. Before moving ahead and show you the another examples, I would like to share you one mathematical concept. Suppose you divide any number by any other number, say n. You should remember that the remainder of this division could be 0, 1, 2, up to n minus 1. It can never be n. This is not possible. Say an example, suppose I want to divide x by 3. Then remainder could be 0, 1 or 2. It can never be 3. Similarly, if I divide x by 9, then the remainder could be 0, 1, 2, 3, up to 8. But it could never be 9. Remember this fact. So suppose if someone says you, uh, I divided x by 9 and the quotient is uh, 36 and the remainder is 9, you will immediately say this is not possible. Remainder can never be 9 because you are when you divide any number by 9, the remainder can only be 0, 1, 2, up to 8. But you will say, okay, let me correct it, but. So how will you correct it? You will make 9, 0, and you will increase this number by 1. So the correct answer is 37, comma 0, where 37 is a quotient, and the remainder is 0. Let me take another example. Suppose I say I divided x by 9, and the quotient is 43, and the remainder is 9. You will immediately say that if this is wrong, and the correct answer is increase this by a quotient by 1 that is 44 and this becomes 0. So the correct answer is this. Remember this rule because this would be useful in the subsequent examples. Suppose I want to divide 2, 2, 1, 0, 1, 3 by 9. So let's start, let's scan this dividend from left to right. First step is to write this number as it is. Now add this digit to this one. So 2 plus 2 is 4. Now add 1 to 4, which is 5. Add 0 to 5, which is 5. Add 1 to 5, which is 6. Add 3 to 6, which is 9. So we'll say this is quotient and this is a remainder. But as I already said you, this cannot be the right answer because 9 cannot be the remainder. So the correct answer would be 1 more than this and this is 0. So it is 2, 4, 5, 5, 7 and the remainder is 0. Suppose I want to divide 234 by 9. Write down this digit as it is. Add this digit to this one. 3 plus 2 is 5. Add this digit to this one. This will become 9. Since you know 9 cannot be the remainder, you will correct it to 26, 0. Perfect. So now let me take a very big number, okay? So 9 ones. 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9. So you write this number as it is. Add 1 to this one. So it becomes 2. 2 plus 1 is 3, 3 plus 1 is 4, 4 plus 1 is 5, 5 plus 1 is 6, 
6 plus 1 is 7, 7 plus 1 is 8, and 8 plus 1 is 9. You will say this is the answer. But no, since you already know that 9 cannot be the remainder, you will adjust this to 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 9. So this is the right answer. I hope you have understood the concept. Up to this point of time, we have seen examples in which carry is not generated. Now we'll see examples where carry is generated. So suppose I want to divide 821 by 9. Write down this number as it is. Add 2 to 8. Now 8 plus 2 is 10. And now you will write 0 as it is and the carry is generated. Before moving ahead to 1, you will adjust th this thing. How you will adjust this? So this is the digit which is generating the carry and this is the remaining number. Okay. So we will increase this remaining number as well as the digit which is generating the carry. So 8 will become 9 and 0 will become 1. Once you have done this, now you will move ahead to this digit. Add 1 to 1 which is 2. So the final answer is 91 is the quotient and the remainder is 2. Let's take another example. Suppose you want to divide 568 by 9. Write this digit as it is. Add 6 to 5. It is 11. Which means carry is generated. Okay. Now moving ahead to before moving ahead to 8, you have to correct it. So increase this number as well as this digit. So 5 will become 6 and 1 will become 2. Now I add 8 to 2, which is 10. Again the carry is generated. Okay increase this digit by 1 and increase this number by 1. Remember you have to increase both this digit and the number which is on the left side of this, uh, the digit which is generating the carry. So this will become 63 and this will become 1. Okay, so let's take one more example. Suppose you want to divide 991 by 9. So write down this digit as it is. Add this digit to this one. 9 plus 9 is 18. So 1 is the carry is generated. First adjust this number. 9 plus 1 is 10. Okay. And 8 plus 1 is 9. Now add 1 to this number. Okay. 9 plus 1 is 10. So 1 carries again generated. Increase this number by 1 and this digit by also by 1. So this will become 110 and this will become 1. So this is your quotient and this is your remainder. So easy. So now let's see more examples in which remainder 9 is also there and where the carry is also generated. So suppose you want to divide 729 729 by 9. First write down this digit as it is. Add 2 to 7 which becomes 9. Now add 9 to 9 which is 18. So the carry is generated. Okay. Now adjust this. This will become 79 will become 80 and 8 will become 9. Now this is your answer but no since you already know that 9 cannot be the remainder you will correct it to 81 0 this is your final answer okay 3 6 6 3 9 write down this digit as it is 6 plus 3 is 9 9 plus 6 is 15 so carry is generated so increase this number by 1 which will become 40 increase the digit by 1 which will become 6 now add 3 to 6 which is 9 and 9 to 9 which is 18 so 1 will be then carry will be generated increase this number by 1 which will become 4070 and this will become 9 now since you know that 9 cannot be the remainder you will immediately correct it to 4071 by 9 that's it i hope you have understood the concept and uh, uh, now you would be able to uh, divide any number by 9 please do like this video subscribe to my channel and please share it. I will see you in some other video tutorial with some other trick. Take care. Bye-bye.